More and more companies are shifting to renewable energy sources to reduce their carbon emissions. Shaila Francisco tells us more. Toyota Motor Philippines Corporation has expanded the use of solar facilities in its Santa Rosa plant to further reduce its carbon dioxide emissions. This is in line with the company's goal of fast-tracking its plant carbon neutrality or zero carbon dioxide emissions by 2035 from 2050. The car manufacturer increased its capacity by 0.46 megawatt in addition to the 1 megawatt facility installed back in 2018. Its 1.46 megawatt solar facility now contributes 7 to 10 percent of its total energy requirement. It was also able to reduce carbon dioxide emissions by as much as 1,400 tons per year, which is equivalent to 2.9 million trees planted over 20 years. Overall, the company has spent 94 million pesos for the whole facility as of June. We just have to make some investments, no? but, but the returns are really, uh, it's, it's more than worth it no? uh, in terms of uh, financial uh, rewards and, and uh, even um, yeah, contribution to the environment as a whole. So we want to be uh, the model no? among our initially with our Toyota group. No? We have suppliers, we have dealers. No? We, can, we can cascade this to them and, and uh, show them the benefits of uh, renewable energy and uh, of course uh, overall to contribute to, to environment. The once again tapped Meralco subsidiary Spectrum for the solar facility, the same company they partnered with back in 2018. Spectrum says that aside from Toyota, more companies are now adopting solar facility in their homes and businesses with the technology getting more prevalent. Solar kasi is the one of the uh, one of the quickest way and the most efficient way no, uh, of uh, transitioning to renewable. Uh, other than that, the most important one is of course the cost. No? Uh, solar has the least cost no? and uh, easier to set up. That is why a lot of companies right now can uh, immediately shift to solar and easily uh, uh, you know, benefit from the installations, no? uh, especially if they have uh, uh, a sustainability agenda in place. For now, Panilio advises other companies to consider going solar, noting that financing has become more accessible. A lot of financing companies, no? uh, you can avail of solar, like banks, no? uh, solar loans. Uh, uh, especially for companies, they have uh, they can avail of uh, green loans no? brought about by uh, uh, government banks and also private banks. You're essentially uh, actually buying or investing on savings. No? If you invest in a solar facility, uh, I guarantee, uh, I guarantee you, or ano, the guarantee is ano, around 10 to at least at least 10 percent to 30 percent savings, no, depending on your usage. For its part, Toyota Motor Philippines will continue to embark on green initiatives. It doesn't stop here, of course. This is just one of the main initiatives that we are taking. Over the years, even the vehicles them, itself, no, has undergone so many improvements towards environment, you know, energy efficiency and uh, uh, the CO2 emission from the vehicle itself. No? So we are moving towards that. In fact, right now we are, we, uh, we have launched many models uh, that are hybrid. Shaila Francisco, we are One News.